Kevin, how would you describe what, what happened defensively there in that fourth inning? Uh, I mean, uh, the ball down the line, you know, I thought I caught it. Um, it obviously came out of my glove. I thought I was in foul ground. And, um, you know, I should have just, you know, as soon as I missed it, you know, got the ball in as fast as possible, um, you know, and, um, you know, and just got beat on the on the other one. Um, you know, the ball was hit hard, um, you know, right over my head. But, uh, you know, just uh, if I make the first one, we're out of the inning. What did Aaron Boone say to you when, when he said he was putting Floreal then in that situation? Uh, pretty much that, you know, he, he was taking me out of the game. You know, uh, you know that, uh, you know, he's going to sit me and, uh, you know, I, uh, I got to make those plays, you know, obviously, um, you know, help our, our help our team win. You said it wasn't a punishment. How, how did you view it? I mean, I got I got benched, you know, what I mean, like I got benched during the game, um, you know, um, you know, that's uh, that's 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 rough, you know, uh, especially when, uh, you know, all you want to do is uh, produce for your team. And, um, you know, your first two at bats are, are strikeouts. So, um, you know, it, it is what it is, um, you know, and I just got to prepare um, for tomorrow. That second catch is obviously a tough play. Is mm -hmm. it is the disappointment with yourself in the moment before in your mind when you're thinking it was just completely different? <laughs> Uh, I mean, you know, you, you got to move on. You know, uh, as, as, as hard as it is, and especially when you do, uh, when you miss a play like that, um, you know, that, you know, that I make all the time, uh, it's, it's rough. But, uh, no, uh, you know, I, I feel like I move forward from that. Um, and I just, you know, couldn't make the second play. It looked like the judge came over and said something to you after that second play. What was his kind of message for you? Ah, uh, you know, Move on, you know. Um, you know, that's pretty much what we got to do. We got to move on, um, and you know, those, those are tough plays. And um, you know, when when you're the guy that doesn't make the play, you know, it's rough. Um, you know, especially when you you want to make the play for your team. And um, you know, you're just saying, hey, let's go, next one, next one. How hard is that? You had the fans at you. It looked like you were really de devastated by missing that ball. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I don't know how I missed it. Um, you know, it was in my glove, and all of a sudden it's out of my glove. And, um, you know, next thing you know, you know, runners are running all around and, and scoring. So, um, you know, it's a play that uh, you got to make. You, you feel you could have refocused and continued in the game? You'd been on too. Yeah, I mean, um, you know, especially when, when stuff like that happens, uh, all you want to do is fight. You know, you just want to you want to find a way to, um, you know, produce for your team. The next time you come up, the next time you're on defense, you try to find a way to – to somehow impact the game that, uh, you know, kind of evens it all out, you know. Aaron, does this get in your head at all when you strike out your first time up here hearing loud boos right away? Does that impact you in any way, or are you able to shut those out? Uh, no, I mean, uh, I think the – the most important one for me was uh, with men in scoring position. You know, uh, when people aren't on, it's uh, you know it's a lot more different. But uh, you know, when guys are in scoring position, uh, and you know you have a chance to um, you know get on the board, you know you want to you want to get on the board. Man.